CTV News at 5 with Hudson Mack. Good evening. Thank you for being here. Hudson Mack is away tonight. We begin with a major development in the story of a Vancouver Island toddler diagnosed with a rare cancer. Three-year-old Hannah Day's family was thrown into turmoil earlier this month when a large cancerous mass was found in her abdomen. Her parents left their jobs to be by her side in Vancouver, putting a huge strain on the family and its finances. But as CTV's Stephen Andrews shows us, the community has come together to help. And today, Hannah's mother returned home to Langford to show her gratitude. Leaving BC's Children's Hospital is difficult for this mother. Even under police escort to ensure her swift return to Vancouver Island, this is valuable time away from her daughter. Three-year-old Hannah is fighting a rare cancer, and doctors expect she will spend the next year being treated with chemotherapy and surgery in Vancouver. Since her diagnosis earlier this month, her parents, Brooke and Rob, have been barely a step away, leaving their jobs to maintain a constant vigil by Hannah's side. It has been increasingly an emotional and financial challenge. But that is about to change. A brief journey from Vancouver to Victoria's in a harbor and waiting in Langford, family, friends, and a check for $10,000. Hannah's mother is overwhelmed. The one thing that I uh, wish this money could pay for um, and do would be to take Hannah's pain away, you know. But this money won't, you know, but it will make sure that she has a better future. The man who heads the group of realtors donating the money says they are touched by Hannah's story and hope their gift will inspire others. There's a lot of need out there. So dig into your pockets and help out. Imagine if it was your child. Um, yeah, you can help make someone else's life better. That's what it's all about. And more people are digging into their pockets. So far, the family has received $30,000. That is going to help us huge. That's going to make sure that, you know, we can stay by Hannah's side for a while, you know, and not have to worry about returning to work and just focusing on Hannah. Doctors say Hannah is responding well to treatment. She actually starts her second round of chemo today, um, and she's doing great. I mean, if I, you know, didn't know she was on chemo and the weight loss, I mean, I would not know I have a sick child. But the reality is Hannah will need every ounce of energy she can muster comforted by the only people who can make that fight less painful. Stephen Andrew, CTV News, Victoria.